Hey guys, welcome back. Let's catch this sweetie fire, sweetie fly real quick. So sweetie flies, if you know their patterns, you can catch them before you get a certain item. It's kind of tough, but this one is one that's easy enough to catch. They actually land and fall asleep eventually at some point. And once they land and fall asleep, you can catch them. So here's the sweetie fly of this area. It's a lovely sweetie. And it's a, a heart lollipop. So a little bit different than the other one. This local area sweetie fly. Uh, while my last recording was exporting in between episodes, I went and just caught a quick few bug snacks to turn into the ranch. So that we could start or we could continue upgrading our pack. Right, three more when we get into the next size. But first, huh? you look excited. You're really doing it. Your teeth. You're bringing everybody back. I can't with your teeth, man. You even got Befika here. She's awful. Agreed. You know what we should do? We should throw a welcome back party. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, I... You're really... You even got Befika. I did the wrong one, sorry. What kind of music do we... Oh, I didn't know we could change the music. Nope. Yeah, this is the best. Ah, let's mingle. Hey, Beth. Hey there, bestie. Good to see you. Finally, somebody worth talking to. Living here is better than that cave, but it's still pretty dull. Like, where's the drama at? Thanks for coming to the party, Beth. I, like, live here now? You started a party around me. Well, I'll take what I can get. <laughs> How's the bug juice? Isn't this just water? Well, uh, it, it's bug infused. So it's about as strong as you? <laughs> I give this party a two out of ten. You're the worst. I dislike you. Oh, hey, you remember Charlie? How's my little sprout doing? He miss his papa. You're looking at oh, me when you say that. Of course he does. Maybe you should let me watch him for a few days. Oh, maybe even a week or a year or two. Granville, welcome back. How's the barn? Well, it's good and locked. Uh, great. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's good to be secure. Awkward. What happened to the snacks you were babysitting for me? Great catching up with you, buddy. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that good dancing. Doing good work, Philbo. Hope you're uh, having a good time, buddy. You should go and mingle with your new friends. I am. I want to talk to you too, though. You are my friend too, Philbo. I like you the best. So far. Hey, Wambus. Well, howdy, stranger. Seems you're getting along just fine. Farm's doing okay on my end. Shindigs like this don't sit right with me. Feels like I should be getting work done. Welcome to the party, Wambone. We are not friends. <laughs> it just walks away. Uh Come on, we are not buddy. friends. It's a party. Drink, mingle, wild. Beth Africa doesn't wild. wild. With you? As if. My new bestie is the only reason I'm here. That's me. Wambus, Gramble, you two probably have loads to that's talk about. That's no, not that's not the no. That's so. I got plenty to say to you. Oh yeah. Hmm. Well, go on and say it. It's your fault we're in this mess. If you'd have let us eat your precious livestock, we could have kept together. The floor they is lava, guys. Weren't livestock. They were my little ones, my kin. You lied and stole them away because you can't grow food for yourself. These walking the vegetables are your family. I got news for you. Oh, Grandma. balloon. Bug snacks will never love you. You don't know a thing about love. That's why your wife left you. I'm going to do violence. Oof. To you. <laughs> I'm gonna hey, do let's, violence let's to you. All take a breath here and Don't act like you're in charge. If you had the spine to lead us, everybody would still be here. Don't you mean trip? Dang, Wambus. Fine! All y'all gang up on me. And don't make me wrong. You all want trip me back so bad? Go find her yourself. Hey, uh, Wambus. You gonna 
You gonna take care of those cacti for us? Um, hey, Philbo, well, you all right, my buddy? Ideal, but maybe after a few dozen more parties, we'll all be friends again. Uh, either There's way, there's optimism. For being here, buddy. Oh, hey, I just You're realized welcome. you haven't had any bug snacks yet. Oh, you must be starving. Well, here, have a strabby on me. Maybe we can end this night on a high note. Um, you know, I don't know oh, if I want to eat that. At least try it. You gotta be curious, right? You know, my, my journalistic integrity oh, forbids me. How can you write about bug snacks without first-hand experience? All right, fair enough. That's Down the, the hatch. Oh, oh no, oh no. Uh, are, are you okay? Oh gosh, I'm so sorry, buddy. <laughs> I'm in the toilet. I uh, guess you're allergic to bug snacks. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> Just give me All some right. space. As long as you're fine, I'll um, I'll get out of your hair. All right, and now the desert is open. Hey, man, I'm gonna go to the desert. Okay, you gotta get out the way of your teeth. I we are feeding you something else to get rid of those teeth. I can't even with those horrific because they're white, so they look like teeth, but then they got the red spots all over them, and it's not okay. Scorched gorge. Ooh, this is a new weather. It's like a dust storm. All right, got a bunch of new things here. We got Scorpenio, the snack lobs fiery peppers at anything that catches its attention. Pop tick. They are too small to catch in a trap, but maybe some heat will puff them up. Oh, lost that one. That's alright. There's another one over here. Chee poof. These things never land. If only there was a way to catch them midair. So chee poof is what uh Wiggle had on her foot suddenly. Still not sure how she did that. Uh, oh. Cromdo, a shifty, surly salesman, bitterly pragmatic. Wambus, trust him as far as I can throw him, which is 31 feet as of last Tuesday. <laughs> what is this? Oh, hot sauce. Add a kick to your snacks with this spicy sauce. Spuddy. It protects its territory by charging at intruders with its powerful jaws. Cromdo. Uh, why do you think I was on top of the canyon? I wasn't paying for the view, pal. Alright. Spuddies are the first thing we're going to catch, because they're pretty easy to catch. Oh. Follow me and I'll show you the deal of a lifetime. Whatever you say, Cromdo. I need to get this Spuddy to... There it is. Come on, Spuddy. Hey. Hey, come here. Come here. You're all right. Hey, hey, yep, that's right. Oh, I hear that other one. Here we go. Perfect. Get back over here. Hey, hey, you. Dang it. Dang it. Here I come telling you they're relatively easy to catch, and now they're getting all troublesome. Come here. Hey. Come on. Here's what I want to see. Get them both together. Come on. Come on. Come on. There it is. Now notice each other. Notice each other. Come on. There we go. Paris buddies. Alright. Oh, did we actually scan them? I don't think that we did. Um, there it is. Yes, we did. No. Protects his territory by charging intruders with the powerful jaws. I don't know if we did or did not, but either way. We did now. Oh, we looked at them now. Another cool thing we can do with spuddies we'll look at later, but you see that cracked wall over there. That's important. Let's take a look around here. Oh. I don't remember what's in there. Uh, let's find out. Yeah, go on in. Go on. Where does this lead to? Is it 
Up? Is that where you're going? Are you going up? No? I don't know where you're going. Coming back out though, that's good news. You're gonna lead something out of there, right? <gasps> you are not. Okay. Alright. Interesting. Okay. Gonna come around this way. And here we should see there she is, Triffany. Hey, yes. Triffany. Oh, goodness. Huh. I didn't notice you there. Hi, how are ya? I'm Triffany Lockwog. Fine, thanks. Don't you know. doing some archaeology. Try not to step on the skulls, ya? Yeah? Will you come you back to Snacksburg? To come back to Snacksburg? Gosh, look around ya. There's a whole civilization buried here, and I barely dug one hole. But I could use a trip to the old research tent once I get a few samples. See these skeletons? Something's fossilized in their stomachs. Looks a bit like a local bug snack. I'll need some live ribblepeeds. If you wouldn't mind, could you help me find some? They like to hide on the walls in these here ruins. <laughs> All right, let's find some ribblepeeds. I do know where one is for sure. A little way to cut through the middle here. And then on the left hand side, there it is. Likes to hide and sit still. Maybe some sauce could get it to move. So, we hit up a snack trap. We get some hot sauce. We put it on the snack trap. And we got a ribble feed. We need three of them. I've only ever seen that one. I'll have to figure out how to get the other ones. But first, we're going to take care of this as well. These guys hate hot sauce, right? Yeah, hates hot sauce. So what we do is we smack that boy with hot sauce and let him fling some fire at it. Heat him up. And then... There you go. Wait, did he just disappear? What? Did he just disappear altogether? He, yeah, he did. I've never seen that before. That was weird. Yeah, you guys transform. Alright, so now they're transformed. Uh, let's see. They love chocolate. That's right. So we're going to set up this snack trap over here where it's away from the guy that can... Set it on fire, and we're going to hit it with chocolate. Go on. Get over there. They're hard to catch. There we go, because you got to wait till they fall in. Got us a pop tick. All right, let's go over to get this one. Okay, he ran away. That's fine, though. We're going to set up this snack trap. Oh, did he see it? He saw it. Dang it. And... Dumb spuddy wherever it went. There it is. Oh, no, he's on fire, too. What? <laughs> that hurt him at all? I don't think it does. Well, you know what? We're going to make this buddy angry because we got this wall right here. There we go. All right. So now we're in here and we can take some pictures. The mirror depicts Grumpuses opening a section of wall near the river. They are carrying some sort of parcel. So we got that mural there. And I do not see any ribblepeeds here. And here, ribblepeeds, any... Aha! Didn't know you were there, fella. There we go. There's a second. Alright, let's see if I can find a third. Back here, maybe? Oh, got some more skellymans. Nothing, though. Okay, aha! There's the other ribblepede. Very nice. I also had no idea those were there. 
my other game, I just caught that one Ribble Pete three times. Here we go, three Ribble Peets. Hey, Triffany. We're gonna give you a Ribble Hand. And another Ribble Hand. And then... Oh, well, yeah, we'll make just a Ribble Arm. There we go. Ribble peeds only look like they have bones. They're squishy all the way through. So what That's weird. did these fellas eat then? Well, like Grandma always said. Other Grumpuses. If you want answers? Dig through their sock drawer. I want to get into that dwelling over there, but the door's blocked up. If you could do something to get that door open, that'd be real swell. I already did. You're good. Oh, I opened the ruins. Kind. Meet me inside. I also already scanned the uh, the mural in there. So if you're gonna ask me to do that, know that it's you know it's done. Check it what are you looking out. at? These murals are still preserved. As far as I knew, we were the first grumps to settle this island. But here we got a thousand years of history unaccounted for. Generations of grumpuses who hunted and ate bug snacks. Just a cosmic reminder that nothing really lasts, eh? Hmm, what's this? Looks like there's a hidden chamber somewhere in the canyon. Could that be where they stored bug snacks? Would you mind finding that chamber? And if there's bug snacks there, please bring them to me. Bye bye now. Can do, Triffany. I'm gonna beat you through the door, yes! All right, let's hope that those spuddies are back over here. Hey, Spuddy, you back? You're not. Well, let's go talk to Cromdo over here then. There you are. No, where, where Cromdo? Where are you going? Bridge for sale. Some assembly required. Buy at your own risk. All sales are final. Offer void or prohibited. Shirt and shoes optional. May contain nuts or shellfish. Guarantees not guaranteed. Hello, friend. Welcome. Come on over. Take a look. I assure you, you won't be disappointed. <laughs> Danny DeVito. Rondo face. The one and only salesman in paradise. Friend, Can I help I you? I got a bridge to sell you. Beautiful, isn't it? Hardwood. New construction, eh? Oh, baby, what a bridge! All yours for just 100 bunk snacks. What do you say? No. That's too much, man. Or, I do not want or oh, need a bridge. Can't afford it? No problem. I got a specialty item just for you. Cheap is free. Follow me, pal. Feast your eyes on this beautiful lunch pad. Totally for sale and not at all stolen. You're itching <laughs> to try it out, I can tell. Uh, my I windmills am. over there got stuck. Why don't you why don't you take it for a spin and knock them into shape? <laughs> Alright. So Don Quixote, I like that. <laughs> take out the windmills. So you pick up a rock, or you pick up whatever, you put it on there. And then there's a launch pad. You take aim. And fire! Now rocks aren't usually what we'll be doing with this. You'll see, uh, I'll show you what this is really used for later. But for now, let's finish Kromdo's mission. He never tells you to do this, and so I struggled to figure this out the first time. I was trying to launch myself, which you can't really do. This doesn't really work to launch yourself. Started your windmills. Oh, feel that hot, sweaty breeze. Now it's time to pay up. What? You used it, you bought it. There's no such thing as a free lunch. Pad. Hey, you could pay me three of those <laughs> cheap. Moves. They think they're so great. Flying around. Let's see how they like flying into my mouth. All right. So the launch pad is how we catch flying bug snacks. 
What we do is we take the launch pad, then we take our snack trap, and then we aim and fire! Got it! <laughs> There's one cheap poof. All right. Where are the other ones? There's another one. All right. I got to watch out for that. B That's a BBQ bunger, new boy. This bung bug snack is much like the uh, much more aggressive than its forest cousin. Oh, right, right. It will literally attack you no matter where you are. We're going to kind of run away up here. There we go. Oh, he'll follow us. Don't want your garbage, Bunger. Bunger, what did I just say? Okay, you keep doing your thing over there. It's fine. I'll catch you this, Chief. Got him. Aha! And the Spuddy is back. Also good news. Come here, Spuddy. We'll get our land launch pad in a second. <laughs> come on. Now over here, come on. Oh, well, I'll only one of you here. Come on. Oop. Got it. And then we got some new... Some new snacks in here. New, new type of weenie worm. There we go. A shy weenie worm. Oh, let's go and scan that. Lazy little weenie worm, it's only motivated by its hatred of ketchup. Only criminals would put ketchup on a weenie worm. <laughs> Alright. Where's the exit to this place? There it is. Okay. Filled on hot sauce. Uh, stairs over here. Let's go grab our launch pad and get that last cheap hoof. here. This residue of cheese dust and chips is evidence of a bug snack. This bug snack seems to appear at night. And this one is during the day. Alright. Got it. And there are three cheap poofs. Let's go feed these to Cromdo because we still need room to catch another pop tick for uh for Wiggle. Everybody just wants to eat bug snacks, man. That's all they want to do. Let's eat. Have a cheap poof for your right hand. And a cheap poof for your right foot. And a cheap poof for your left foot. There you go. Okay, okay. I know you're just itching to get your paws on that bridge. So, I'll cut you a deal, friend. I want a fighter, but it's on this ridiculously tall rock, and it wasn't exactly blessed with stilts for legs. <laughs> All right. There's a fighter that's across the bridge here. It's a unique one. Sweet fighter, similar to fighters, but sweeter. Drifty, sweeter in flavor, true, but still lacks salty. Essentially, what we do is we set up the launch pad. Get that snack trap. But this time, we're going to launch it right over. We're going to wait a sec, though. Right now, because that wind is going to affect it. So, there it is. Wind. Blow it off. There we go.
And now we give Cromdo his Frider. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. There you go. For your left hand. Pleasure doing business with you. Hey, you're my best and only customer. I'm starting to think I should get a better location back in Snacksburg. But uh, moving Good all idea. this inventory across the desert is real sweaty work. I'll need a way to keep cool. If you make both my feet into big bopsicles, uh, then walking the hot sands would be a breeze. But I gotta warn you, you won't find bopsicles in the desert. Better look elsewhere, pal. <laughs> yep, so we can't finish his stuff until a while later. That's fine, though, because we can talk to Triffany! Have a shy weenie worm in your right arm. Hmm. The taste is a little off. I'm wondering how long those snacks were in there. Did you find anything else in the chamber? A massive trap pit and a lot of corpses. Mm, that's a little intense for an ancient storage shed. You know, that just might have been a burial chamber. But if that's where they put their dead, why are all these bones out in the open? Hmm. Well, I gotta solve this mystery. Sorry, but I won't be going back to Snacksburg. What about Wambus? Wambus wants me back? Well, he can come out here and tell me himself. <sighs> You might have heard things haven't been too good between us. I keep telling myself I'll get around to C&M, but it's just easier to, uh, stay out here with the bones. When was dressed a cactus to look there. like you? <laughs> I guess the big love really misses me. Well, I miss him too, but I'm still mad. I thought maybe time would help. But time's just pushing me closer to the grave, and I'm not feeling any better. I suppose I could try being among the living for a while. Yay! All right. Let's go explore. No, there isn't a spuddy on our tail. Let's come back in here, see if there's anything else to take a picture of. No. All right. We are going to catch that shy weenie worm, though. All right. Nothing else to look at in here. No, no. Okay. We do want to do this. Where does this lead to? I don't remember. Um... No? Alright. <laughs> Fair enough. I do know there's another... Is it over here? We'll try this one then. Go Strabby, go. Here it is. Get out here. Yes! A green peel bug. It's a unique peel peel bug. Oh, Strabby, stop. Strabby. Strabby, stop. There we go. Do we have our... Yes! Now that it's nighttime... We got some... Different boys out here. White Chipoof, a rare Chipoof that exclusively comes out at night. Fefika, a.k.a. the Cooler Chipoof. Those doofuses, I told you, they're so easy to catch. There we go. Got it. No, I need to save my one spot. Because I want to catch one more pop tick. And this is the best place to do it. Over here. 
Oh, there it is, actually. Nice. I'm going to set the snack trap pretty far away. I'm going to put some chocolate on this bad boy. Not you, Pop Tick. I want your brother over there. I want your buddy. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to lead him with some chocolate. Get over here. Said, get over here. Come on. There you go. And there. And the spuddies have got themselves knocked out again. Cool. We got everything we need. Let's head back into town. And you know what? We're going to finish this next time or we'll, we'll get their conversation next time. We'll see you guys then. Bye.